In this video, I will help you guys with the metric system and metric units in particular. On this paper are the metric units that we'll go over. Kilo, hecto, deco units, which can be liters, meters, or grams. And then deci, centi, and milli. There is an analogy that can help you with this to remember how to, what the order is, and how to um, move your decimal points over. King Henry died unexpectedly drinking chocolate milk. The K stands for kilo, H, hecto, D, deco, U stands for the units, V for deci, C for centi, and M for milli. So if you have a test, you can just remember this funny phrase, King Henry died unexpectedly drinking chocolate milk. And then if you have a problem, you can just write the letters in order on your sheet. And let's just say we want to convert milligrams. Well, let's say let's convert one liter and how many milliliters does that equal? We can pretend we have a decimal point in front of the one One point zero liters is the same as one liter, and we can pretend, on um, since liter is a unit, that we can put a decimal point in front of the U. And how many spots do you have to move it over before it's in front of the milliliter? One, two, three. Okay. So we can move our decimal point over three spots. One, two, three. And that will give us 1,000 milliliters. And you can also use that to convert kilograms, kilograms, kiloliters, and so forth back over to the unit measurement. So if we have one kilogram, there's the kilogram K for king. We can put our decimal point in front of there, just if that will help you out. And then we need to convert this to units, which is in the middle. So how many does that take? Let's see. One, two, three. Okay, so we can move it over one, two, three spots. And one kilogram equals 1,000 grams. Okay, but you can also do it in reverse too. So, 
if 1000 meters was first, how many kilograms would that equal? So meters is the unit measurement and we have to convert it to kilograms. So we're going to have to move the decimal point over to the left side now instead of the right. Okay, our decimal point is in front of the zero and we have to move it over, let's see, one, two, three times before it's in front of the K. Okay, so it looks like one, two, three, that would be one kilogram. 1,000 meters, well, I'm sorry, we're doing wrong unit. That would be kilometers. Okay, well, if you have any questions or comments, Feel free to let me know. Thank you. Bye.